Hey everyone, it's Jenny. I'm back with another haul video. So, um, I ordered a bunch of things. They've all been coming in from all different places. So this is kind of another next plate haul. Um, and then I do have to film a project video. So I'll, you'll probably see a couple more things coming out of my channel in the near future. Okay, so, um, <clears throat> and then I'm going to be pulling the names for the um, giveaway challenge winner soon. I still have to open up a couple boxes that came in um, And then once I do that, I will make the announcement probably sometime this weekend Okay, so let's get started. Um, they're just kind of from all over the place. A lot of it is from Amazon um, And then I do have like one Daiso thing. So let me just kind of go over So I couldn't find my bells like this. Um, these are actually a little bit bigger than what I wanted <clears throat> But I do like this um, like opaque white kind of look um and i do have pink ones in my cart i'm hoping to find some smaller sizes i did order some from aliexpress but i can't find the ones that i ordered previously that's so irritating anyway um so i i got these just for now because a lot of my christmas stuff is red and white so i figure i have red metallic but i wanted some white bills so i did get this and then um i ordered this size um ornaments these are the smaller size. I, I bought a bunch of the larger ones, but um, I ordered the, I guess it's like a, um, what is it called? Snow globe ornament maker from um, Scrap Diva Designs, which I think it was designed by Nicole Silhouette and it requires the smaller um, type. So I just thought I would order it. You know, it's really weird because I went to my local Ben Franklin and they don't have that size anymore. So um, good thing I ordered it from Amazon. Okay, I also ordered this from Amazon. It's, um, I just googled, like, or searched for cake toppers. I don't know why I got this guy, because I don't think, I don't know if that's a Sanrio character. Um, but I looked for, like, Hello Kitty cake toppers, because I think that's what Eileen, um, said she did once, and she got some cute stuff. So, um, it came with a bunch of different Sanrio characters. This is a Christmas version that I wanted. Um, so these are all the characters I got. There's one more that I actually used already. So I will do another project share once I'm able to finish that project. But this one is super cute. So these are a really good size too. Um, so I will have links below. I also bought this one, um, which they're a lot bigger. So um, they may fit in my larger snow globe stuff, but they don't fit in the smaller stuff that I have. But that's okay because you need different sizes anyway. And then this came from um, Daiso. So I like to buy these trays because then when I'm working on like small stuff, especially embellishments, and like they need to dry or whatever, then I can have trays and they can stack. Like I can stack them this way. And so it's very handy. So I bought four of them. Um, and the I kind of like the clear ones because it's not as distracting as some of the other ones I have. But they can also be um, altered. So I can put like a piece of paper or I can um, use like, uh, what is it called? Vinyl and like personalize it. So I, I just got the plain ones. And then, okay, so this is from... This is from Rhoda, which is um, Happy Little Happy Little Corner, I think, is her um, IG uh, shop name. And <clears throat> as you can see, I bought a lot of sequins. I ordered more, <laughs> so I have another order coming. Um, and I also ordered from Ariel, who is Creative Mojo Wholesale Studio. Um, I just like their mixes. I think, like, I have a hard time mixing my own. And if I see a mix that I like, then I tend to buy it um, because it's a lot easier for me. These are really cute. So they have the little flower sequins and then it says love. So they're like conversation hearts. So kind of good to get ready for like Valentine's Day. So I bought several of those. Oh, here's another one. Um, I'm trying to find all the ones that are the same so I don't duplicate it. So I got these. These are more Christmassy, um, very pastel, a lot of light blue, pink, and white. So I got several of those. Here's another one. And then I got, this is more minty looking. So it's like mint um, and pink hearts and snowflakes and white as well. Several of those. This one is the same. And then this is more like candy cane or peppermint looking, which I really like. I really like this one a lot. I'm, I'm kind of gravitating towards peppermint kind of stuff for my decor this year so I I wanted I knew I wanted to get some of that these are different so these are the 
They're more Valentine-y because it has like the heart in there. Um, see the heart polymer clay piece along with white and pink and like an iridescent looking, looking one. And here's another peppermint one. And then these are like, um, they're, they're kind of like the other pink Valentine's one, except it has also the mint blue inside. So I did purchase quite a bit from her and then she gave me a free gift, which is these um, little pom-pom charms. So thanks Rhoda for that free gift. And I like to buy from Rhoda and support other local um, crafters. So um, go check out her IG store. I will link it below. She doesn't always have stuff available, but recently she's been doing a lot of de-stashing and, um, <clears throat> and selling a lot of kits and stuff. So anyway, so I will likely be using those in the near future or gifting them um, oops, sorry, to other people I'm sending happy mail to. And then um, this is probably... Oh no, I have a lot from here. Okay, so this is all uh, KS Craft dies. Yeah, KS Craft dies, and they've just been kind of coming in. Uh, some of them are older and some of them are newer. This is an older set. So this is called Cute Christmas Decoration Supply. So it, it's a tag kit, and then it comes with all the sentiments. I've been looking for a little bit more like tag related, um, just because it's easier and it's easier if they match. Like it, I know it fits. Because um, I've been having a hard time. A lot of my die cutting sentiments are large and so it doesn't fit nicely on the project so um, I think that I've been on a quest to just find more of that so this one is more like a charcuterie board and um, these sentiments match and they like they go into here I think you can also make it a shaker if you want to but I'm probably just going to use them more as tags um, this is the another gumball machine <laughs> another one it's a smaller one though from like Erica's one and then it has the Santa hat this one I mainly bought for the word joy. I didn't really want, I didn't, I don't have a need for the mustache, but this is a bag topper. Um, so it's kind of like Santa's mustache. I actually like the word joy, which is also a bag topper. And then this is the elf set, which I've been waiting for. I finally got here. So you get two, I think two different size elves. They're really cute, their faces. So um, I'll be, I don't know if I'll be able to make this this year, but maybe next year. And then my large Pixie Dust Designs order came in, as I uh, mentioned in my mug video, <clears throat> that I did purchase more of their new designs. So they came in while I was on my trip. Um, so I haven't had a chance to cut them yet, but I think they're super adorable. So um, the thing I like about their packaging is that it says on top what it is. And then you have a picture on the back for reference, which is awesome. So this is <clears throat> this is the gingerbread mugs. This is the Mrs. Claus, which is why I love Mrs. Claus with the, the glasses. Look how cute the glasses are. Oh my gosh. So I got to make one so she goes with Santa. This is an attachment piece for the mugs so that you can make it into a box, which is super cool. So if you want to uh, make the mugs and put treats inside, that's a really good, good way of doing it. And it's all like measured out for you. And then it comes with some words. So it comes with warm wishes, hot cocoa, and Merry Christmas. And then I got the, um, this is the gingerbread house mug, which I am like dying for. That is so cute. It looks just like my Target one that I found. And then this one is the gnome. So I'm not a gnome person by any chance, <laughs> but I don't know, something about this mug just appealed to me. So I, I did get it. And then, um, and then this one I thought was really cool. Um, it comes in two parts, I guess, A and B. It's the music box. So... It's really cool how you can open the box and then the image will pop up and then you can you have space to put like your goodies and stuff. So and it comes with the cute penguin. Super it's super cute. This is kind of what it looks like. So I was very um interested in that one. So I did spend a lot of money at Pixie Dust Designs, but I so far I'm liking their stuff. And then this one I just wanted to share with you. I'm very disappointed. <laughs> so I ordered this directly from Amazon. It's from Cra Craft wait cardstock warehouse here and it came open you guys and this is how they sent it like they just i don't want to show you my address but they just slapped on the label right on the packaging and it wasn't even wrapped so some of my stuff is like dirty and that's great you know they usually send me my stuff in good condition so i'm kind of upset about that so i gotta go complain to amazon because i don't know if it's an amazon thing or a craft, uh, cardstock warehouse thing but you know Hello, it's paper. You really should be protecting it. 
uh, but I do like this color. I use it a lot. This is the cotton candy color. So, and I was running out of it. Okay, so that is all I have to share. That was a lot um, from all over the place. And I will get on to my next video. See you in the next one. Bye.